Excitement is building for the solar eclipse. Now, although Montana will not be in 100% totality, it'll be a partial solar eclipse, but nonetheless, it should be pretty spectacular, especially across southwestern Montana. I'm Chief Meteorologist Mike Hurd. Let's dive into the anatomy of this solar eclipse. Most of Montana will be in the penumbra. That's the partial shadow uh, that'll be casted once the moon gets between us and the sun, casting a shadow on the earth. But for those lucky enough to be in 100% totality, they'll be in the umbra or the full shadow, and it's about 70 miles wide. So because we're in the partial solar eclipse, uh, you do not want to look at this with the naked eye, even when it's at 95% eclipsed. Uh, we want you to be safe while you're watching this solar eclipse. So we have provided you with a few solar eclipse glasses out there. So make sure you use them. So sunglasses will not provide sufficient uh, protection. And only look at the sun through, again, approved solar filters like the eclipse glasses that we handed out. Even safer uh, is to observe indirectly by projecting the sun's image with a pinhole or binoculars on like a white paper plate, for example. So those are some of the uh, better tips that uh, we can pass along as we get ready for the solar eclipse. Now the important question is, will it be cloudy? Well, we have a disturbance moving in Sunday evening and early Monday morning, and we'll update this throughout the entire weekend, but as of Friday evening, uh, the forecast is showing clearing skies early Monday morning. So before it even begins, hopefully skies will be clearing in the Bozeman area. So it begins at 10.15 in the morning and we should hit the max eclipse about 95% at around 11.35, 11.36, somewhere in there. And the forecast is generally mostly sunny to partly cloudy and probably staying a bit on the smoky side and it'll wrap up at around 12.55 p.m. in the afternoon. Now as you look nationally, Again, that 100% line is where most folks are going to try and view it. Looks pretty good. Anything with a green circle here uh, is uh, clear to party cloudy skies, and that does include much of the Pacific Northwest. But as we take a look at southwest Montana, we're in that 90 to 100% totality range again, and it's looking green. So we should have good visibility, although there could be a touch of cloud cover out towards Billings and down towards Pocatello. And that 100% line is, again, is where most folks will try and view that total solar eclipse. So, again, make sure you use the uh, solar eclipse glasses. We handed out about 1,000 of these over the last week or so. And uh, they are logoed. So we would love to see your picture on the solar eclipse when you're looking at it. Send us a picture and put it on our Facebook page. We'd love to see it here at kbck.com and our KBCK Facebook page. So that's the wrap on that partial solar eclipse across southwest Montana. Hope you're getting excited and ready for it and we'll continue to monitor the forecast as we get closer to the event. I'm Chief Meteorologist Mike Hurd for kbck.com.